the general direction. All right, so long line. So basically she's paying attention to these kids over here. So as long as she is doing her calming signals, so you see how she is kind of air scenting and then doing a head turn and then she'll look again and do a head turn. She can do all those things, but if she were a little bit more excited about that, so here they're coming a little closer, see the head turn again? Mm -hmm. She's coping really well, but if I start to worry about how she's gonna cope, I'll ask her to move away. Poppy, good girl. So I will let her move this direction. And basically at this point, I follow her. So as long as she's moving away from the trigger, or not directly towards it is really what I should say. She can explore and sniff the environment and I keep her feeling loose. So, great. so the line can go out as she goes a little bit faster than me. And if I need to stop her, I'll slow stop. So I'll point my hand down a little bit and then you'll see her bounce back and you can gather up some loops again. So ultimately you wanna stay fairly close to her, but if she needs a little line to go where she's going, that way she feels loose. And she chooses where to go as long as she's not going at a trigger. Great. So, very good. So, if I want her to move away from there, I can also do a vibration on the leash with some mind pulling. And some dogs respond really well to this, and some don't care. She doesn't care. So, <laughs> that is one of the things on the sheet when you go look at it. Okay. Happy. Good girl. So, as long as she kind of heads away from whatever she's looking at, I'm fine with that. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Oh, Very good. So she wants to head in people's yards, and I'm going to ask her not to do that. I think that's smart. <laughs> yeah. So what I would like is for her to head towards these streets over here. So there is a dog in this house. You can see it on the backboard. Oh, yeah. I do know. Good. Yeah. She hears that dog. But she's sniffing it for the environment instead of going over there or getting too interested which is a really good way for her to figure out. If I just stay calm and explore, then I'm okay. The, the person just came out and checked what his dog was barking at. I'm glad she did not let the dog out, so she's looking. So your arousal yeah. go up a little bit. So I can move good. her away real quick. Hi, Poppy. So okay. did you see her tail just start to go? Yeah. One of the advantages of using the long line is you are just far enough back, you can see things way earlier than if you're walking on a short leash. Okay. Big shake off. So she I'll says, see. wow. All right. So if you was I supposed to give her treats then or not? Depends. So here's the kids again. Very nice. So she's coping much better with the kids than with the dog over there. So, and the guy, is he letting the dog out? You would hope not, but. All right. So we're going to maneuver this way. All right. Because do you see which direction she went? She didn't Opposite go back towards to, the dog. Opposite to, yeah. She went straight away from the dog. So she, and she knows those kids are over there, but they're minding their own business. So she's doing good. So do you see how this keeps her feeling on loose leash? Uh -huh. It gives you a little bit more ability to keep her safe. Yes. Hmm. This is so if a dog popped up there, I would still use my let's go. Poppy, let's go. And we can move away quickly. All I have to do is point out to her, I'm going that way. If I move that way, she will too. Good girl. So you saw how fast that response yeah, was? Yeah, that was good. That's why we want that let's go trained really well. And you can use touches, find it, whatever is going to work for you okay. in the context. Okay. So if you need to manage her, she still should respond to all that stuff, even on the long line. Hey, lady. She's like, I'm thinking about digging. Here. <laughs> Very good. So doing this in places where there are smells and things for her to do is ideal. That way she can behave normally. Mm -hmm. um, but if she is worried about something, the goal here is always to have her move away. And that should happen on regular leash, too. Right little girls wandering this direction. So, and you can see how as she slows down, I get closer, and then I allow her to go out as she is needing a little more line. Okay. And I will demo how to do the long line at her house. Okay, perfect. Very good. All right, so, do you want to head home? Sure. Very good. I think she's doing great. Okay, good. Hey, Poppy. And this turned out to be not quite... We saw some good dogs. Yeah, and not it wasn't really as well. bad as I remember.